Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific a crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle one glance and you know where we are it is one of the most recognizable arenas for the beautiful game in the world and boy does it add to the occasion game this between two very high quality sides treat for everybody here well on the face of it peter we would appear to have high caliber meeting with very little at stake but then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in and this becomes a big incentive it changes the dynamic so there's plenty at stake for them which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction and hopefully the style of contest So it's down to business here. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Yeah, Thiago Silva. He's a player who doesn't seem to have any weaknesses at all, Peter. He's strong, he's quick, he's technically gifted and very comfortable in possession. What I particularly find impressive about him, though, is his consistency and his reliability. He just never seems to, to make a mistake. Opposition strikers could be in for a hard time of it today. Yeah, the scourge of so many strikers. And here's Fernandez. Caicedo battles to win it back. Looks to clip it forward. Casemiro does well to read it and intercepts. Rafael Varan. Varan goes looking. Bruno Fernandez gets it out to the wing. A real chance if he can get through. He's got it, and he's got time. Chelsea have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion. Chance! Casemiro. Fernandez, Nkunku, Chelsea have a free kick. Tries to get it clear. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Thiago Silva. Just brushed off the ball there. He's through the middle. Sanchez can claim that. Cucurella. Forward it goes. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away and he has shown him a yellow card <laughs> defending of the desperate variety Fofana He's pulled off a fine save. 
Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Diogo Dallo. Walk forward. What does he try from here? It's on a plate. Oh, he's in! Cleared without complication. And that's been one straight back. And it's Shaw. Fernandez with a good steal, well played. Now the counter. He's played him through. It's a great ball. Goes to finish! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. Played out to the right. Plenty waiting in the middle. McTominay can get it clear. And Kunku. Fernandez. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. James! McTominay gets it back. Kukurela. And the first 45 minutes are up. And both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. So, reviews on the first half. It's been a pretty abject performance. No efforts at goal. I'm struggling to remember the last time we had that. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. And we're underway again. Manchester United, pretty fortunate not to be trailing at half-time. They've been lacklustre and, and second-best for me. And if ever a situation demanded a telling off from the boss, it's this one. He has to spark a reaction. He's had a shot! Goal! And the second half is off to a flyer! Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. Manchester United draw first blood here. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. Kukurela, Garnacho battles to win it back. with the ball, it's a contest to keep an eye on. Attempts to play it through. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Played in deep. Tries to get it clear. He's played it short. Deep cross. Kunku. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. 
Lister shoots! A wonderful effort, all by himself. Well, the run was really impressive. The finish was depressive, and expectations were not met. Brushed off the ball there. Breaks on here. And it's Rashford. Garnacho. That's good defending, very good defending. Good take, and he's had a look. James, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Thiago Silva plays it forward. He's got away. Cut out in the nick of time. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Caicedo does well there. Alert. Hoists it forward. Tries lifting it over. Ball in, just miscalculated. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. He gets past his man. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. And here's Rashford. Thiago Silva with the clearance. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Manchester United can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. He's left his man, and he has been fouled there. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Thiago Silva gets into the right position to intercept. Looking to break out here. Anthony. And that will be the final act. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Well, this game looked to have nil-nil written all over it, but credit to them, they upped their game in the end, and I thought they got what they deserved. Thanks to Jim, we both wish you a very good evening.